What's up YouTube, I'm just another guy and welcome back to Webster United. So yes, read it and weep. We are currently in the Champions League final. We've got Sevilla at Wembley. You know, we love Wembley. We may have lost here this season to Chelsea, but hopefully, hopefully we can win the Champions League in our 10th season. What an incredible accomplishment that would be. Uh, let's continue forward. Hopefully there's no spoilers. If not, I'll have to edit that out. Um, because I will be wrapping up this series in the next episode if we manage to win this. If not, I will be doing an end of season light update. And then we'll continue this series on. Um, so let's continue forward to team selection, I guess. Uh, did I press it? I don't want to continue too far forward because I want to do my team. All right. So... This is the team I believe I'm going to be playing. Let me just double check. Um, I want to put uh, Makey on the bench. Um, apart from that, yes, this will be the team I will go out with. As you can see, Sakura is currently injured and so is Tervis. So a few changes to what would be considered a normal starting lineup for us. But apart from that, this is one of the strongest teams, if not the strongest team I can play. So let's go through this. In goal, we have Laranus. Right back, we have Ke uh, Kiatia. Kiata, I don't know why I butchered that so badly. Uh, centre backs we have Cardoza and Ndoy. Um and left back we have Batu. As you can see, just a few bad performances from uh, Zindalio, Zindalio has resulted in him Batu being pushed out to the left and Ndoy being put at centre back. And it's currently been working so far. They've all been playing well recently, so there's no real indication that I need to change that. Midfield we have Thorpe as deep line playmaker, defend and Flores ball uh, box to box midfielder support. Right attacking mid, we have Sal uh, Salvamini. Salvamini at right attacking mid. Left attacking mid, we have Levitt. Center attacking mid, we have Gray. And up front, we have Sousa as poacher. Uh, Gray's not been playing well so far. Um, but I am going to give him a, a, the start in this match. Uh, Kelly is on the bench if need be. Uh, Tobias Christensen is on the bench as well. If um, Salvamini doesn't perform well, I will push Levitt out right and put him there. So, you know, I've got things in place. I'm prepared. Or I've got Torre on the bench. But I'm, I don't know. Christensen's been playing decently. Uh, so let's go into this. 4 2 3 ones. We match up each other's formations. What a record breaker, breaker this could be. 10 years, 10 different accomplishments would have been achieved in these 10 seasons. You know, this would be the perfect, perfect way to end off, I think, FM 14 for me. A, a fantastic accomplishment for the side, hopefully. Uh, one person I pointed, I could see instantly was we have Corker coming up against us. Uh, but apart from that, I don't really recognize anyone else. You may recognize someone, but I don't currently. And I don't really care either. Um, I anticipate a nervy game, and I think the game will most likely go all the way to penalties. David, uh, David, and Vegba Sakor will both be missed by their effect by their respective sides. Uh, Susu is currently the third highest goal scorer in this competition. Hopefully, he can continue that today. And um, let's passionately tell them it's a special day for the port supporters. Give them, you know, give them what they came here for. Go out there, make them happy, win the comp competition for them and for you and for the club and for the badge. Come on. Let's hopefully end off this series in the right way. You know, in the perfect way. Winning the Champions League at Wembley in England, the home of football. With an English team. And straight away an injury to Batu, which does mean um, Makey's going to have to come on. And I will play Kiat around the left and Makey on the right. Um, I'm going to pause this very quickly because I did actually want this on extended highlights. Because I feel it's a big game and I feel it, it deserves some extended highlights. So, Nundoy with the ball. Levitt at wide to Kiata To Alex Gray. Block Garnish is just about to come in. And we get ourselves a corner. Silvermini whipping this in but unable to find a red shirt. And Levitt's picked up the ball. Still going with the ball. Plays it out to Makey. Uh, unable to whip this in. I'm not sure if I should do 2D or 3D. I think I might whack this on 2D. Uh, just because I think that was what I did in the Pentagon. It's been a while since I did the Pentagon. It's been a while since I did the Lifecom. But I will put the goals in director cam in 3D so you can see it. But we'll we'll do it in 2D. So make it out on the right. Whips this one in. Unable to find a green, a red shirt. A Salva Mini. Levitt scored. Richard Levitt. The fucking... Oh my god, Richard Levitt. There could not have been a better guy to have scored that goal. Richard Levitt, the man that has been here all his career since the very start of the save to the very end. Silver Mini, very unlucky not to have scored it. Richard Levitt just pokes it in as it hits the post for the second time. Keeper a bit unfortunate as well, hitting the post, hitting him. Going, staying on the line, you know, anything could have happened. 
But wow, Richard Levitt, captain of the team, scoring in the final when we require it. And we're currently all over Sevilla. Seuss running to get the shot away. And maybe this is Sevilla's chance to get their first shot of the game as they try and open us up with a counter-attack. Uh, but no, that's no chance, chance of happening. The Doi managed to cut that out just about. And Kiata, one great challenge, but unable to prevent the cross coming in. And it was a dangerous-looking cross. It could have easily have, you know, been bubbled in from one of the Yonka, one of the retreating defenders. And good save from Larinus. Turning that behind, for some reason, that is a goal kick. We must have took a deflection afterwards. Kiata to Gray out on this left hand side attacking. Kiata Flores to Kiata. Not, doesn't seem very comfortable crossing it in. As Richard Levitt goes for a shot. Push up, probably should have been looking to play that across the face of goal. More, you know, more chance of scoring that from that angle as well. Would have been a lot better to have done that. But we're going to go in at half time with a 1 0 lead and all over Sevilla. Wow. You've got one hand on the cup, go out there, make sure you have both hands on it, come the end of the game. And I'm going to do the very cheap way of getting a reaction on the team talk, probably for the last time in FM Full Team. Come on, Ebsley, let's play out this 45 minutes, win the Champions League, and then we can finish. Knowing we won every single competition, that was possible. Maybe we didn't win every single league, but at least we got out of them, we got promoted back to back. To back 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 times. As all know, Sevilla trying to create a comeback and good save from Larinus and just does enough as Suarez is unable to kick that one in due to a very tight, narrow angle. So, it's getting close. That was a good opportunity. And now Sevilla with the ball yet again. They look like they're going to be the team with all the chances in this second half. And it is Suarez with the goal. Not Luis Suarez, not the one we sold to Birmingham. Don't worry. Um, but Suarez with the goal gives Sevilla the goal to get back in it. Uh, I think it is time we do bring on Liam Kelly. Guy has been in quite incredible for us, Liam Kelly, for his career. Let's see what he can do now. Oh, Richard Levitt, Richard Levitt, Flores. Oh my God, how did we not find the back of the net there? The ball kept whizzing around. Here's Fawn to Kelly, finding Sousa, playing the ball around lovely, playing in the absolute way. Come on, Cardoza. Tutore, Salvamini, Kelly, Sousa. Oh, what a beautiful goal. Sousa with a goal, giving us the lead yet again. Back with our one goal advantage. Come on, Emsley. Now let's hold this lead out until the very end. Get another one if we can, just to secure our advantage. Oh, Miki with the ball. Come on, find the right pass. Trying to find Levitt. A bit optimistic, but we've still got the ball. Salvamini. Oh no, poor pass back to Flores and now this could be a severe counter-attack, Suarez. Ooh, Connick really should be hitting a target from there. Suarez probably would have done better taking the shot himself. Now playing the ball around beautifully again, Liam Kelly. Uh, unable to get the ball to Salvamini. Big ball punted forward and it's actually found Sousa. Trying to find Levitt. Sousa still managed to find the ball and oh, Sousa has just won us the Champions League. Sousa with the second goal of the game. A bit fortunate with the pass originally. A bit fortunate there with the ball babbling off the defender. Uh, and due to that, able to run past both of them quite easily due to probably being off balance. And still, beautiful finish though. You can't take that away from him. Sousa with the two goals. The wonder kid living up to his name. Oh, good save. And Larinus keeping us with our two goal advantage. I think I'll make one more sub. I think we'll bring on... Tobias Christensen, actually, yeah, we'll bring on Tobias Christensen for Salvamini. We'll just play Tobias Christensen out on that right-hand side for the remainder of the game. Last eight, seven minutes of the match, however long he was on for. And the time is up. Sevilla, you better count down because your time in the Champions League final is coming to an end and time is ticking away. You were, you've got to score three goals if you're going to win it. Two goals to just push us to extra time. We've been all over you all game long. I think we thoroughly deserve this competition. I didn't speak about our journey here, um, which is something I actually did want to do. I wanted to speak about who we played on the way to the final, but I guess we'll just save that for the next episode, for the last video of this series, which will be us wrapping up an incredible save. But we have just won the Champions League. Come on, just wind that clock down. Come on, ref. Blow it, blow it a minute early. They're not going to score two goals in a minute. Come on, ref. Oh, God, they might. Fuck. <laughs> oh, God, no. No, 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 Consolation goal. That's just a, a, a fluky consolation. Come on, ref. Whistle. Whistle, ref. Whistle. 
Whistle, 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 whistle. No, ref, 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 ref. Come on, no, ref. No. Ref, come on, ref. Blow full time. That's it. We won the Champions League. Very nearly threw it away at the end there, but we won the Champions League. 3 2 winners on the day, but most importantly, an incredible year for the team. An incredible way to wrap off the series and Football Manager 2014 with such a great sort of live com as well. <laughs> you know, all over them. Um, I know, yeah, I guess we'll read these messages. I bring glory to the team. We win the Champions League for the first time in the club's history. Um, they are delighted. Smith hailed Wondermaker Guy. We lift the Champions League. Um, the press conference as well. Blah, 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 blah. We won it. Um, we won the overachievers, though. Sousa finished top goal scorer in the, con in the tournament with 12 goals. We picked up money for winning the final as well. Where does that put us in the Hall of Fame for my, my career? We were unable to enter the worldwide one. Continentally, we were unable to do it. Nation nationally, we were unable to do it. Um, but as someone from England, we are now the third best manager ever behind two of the greats of, you know, of English management from England. So, you know, there's no doubt one of the greats there. My name amongst them, just another guy. Um, but yeah, what an incredible way to end off. Well, what an incredible way to win the Champions League, really, at Wembley, our second home. So, next time you're back, guys, will be the round up off this save and also the sort of the farewell to FM as well. Uh, there'll probably be some shout outs in the next video as well. Preparing, uh, actually, yeah, there'll we'll probably be some shout outs in the next video as well for those going to do FM15 videos. Uh, put your comments below if you are going to do FM15 videos. I'll probably just shout you out. Um, and also, there'll be a video up soon, hopefully, about series that will be on this channel for FM15. So, until then, guys, peace out.